Morning guys, we are packing really, really, really fast because I overslept. I got all my Spanish books in here and my laptop, all the vlogs, these bags. Oh, this is a mess. Okay guys, heading out. Yeah, got everything, I think. And say bye. Kaya, baby. Bye bye. Bye, sausage. Goodbye. All right, there's Luke and Kaya. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> okay, I'm so lucky I've got such good people around me. They, when, when I grabbed my bags, they actually took them from me and they packed my car for me. So, Maria. Sorry, my car's a bit dirty because this road, they're doing construction on it. The outside, look at that. God. Okay, so, hey, oh, how sweet. They put all my stuff in. I hope they packed everything in the back. I think so. Okay, maybe I should actually just check quick. I'm gonna quickly check, guys. Okay, yeah, they did. They packed everything. And the start, I guys, I haven't driven this far in ages. So the start of an hour and a half drive begins. Guys, I can't believe we're, we are really on this long drive. Oh my God. I haven't done a drive like this since university days. I used to have to drive from my like little farm town all the way to uni and it was like four hour drive. I used to like, my brain used to go crazy. I didn't know what to do with my brain. It was just so exhausting and oh, it was, it was something else, man. So anyway, this is only like half the amount of time, so it's fine. Guys, while I was driving down the road, I drove past these two old bags. Oh my God, I can't even tell you. The lady that I drove past, she actually got out her car the one day and came and yelled at me. She was like, you didn't stop at the stop sign for long enough. And I was like, oh, sorry. And she was like, there are kids that play on the street. And I'm like, oh, look, I'm not blind. I'm not going to hit anyone, you know? And she was like, well, seems to me as you are. But she was like yelling at me. Like it was like pretty hectic. I was like, what? Like, I'm not going to hit anyone. Like, dude. So anyway, I'm not old like you, lady, but I didn't say that to her. She kind of just yelled at me. Like people in America, I promise you, they're so opinionated. They'll just come and yell at you to give, their, to give you their opinion. It's like craziness half the time. Like you watch, you full on watch like fights happen and whatnot, like in public. Like someone will be like, you can't do that. And they'll be like, watch me. And it's, it's, it's insane. <laughs> Free world, America. <laughs> Uh, yeah, anyway, so let's get on with my long, long ass drive. I will update you guys on the trip. And I can't wait to show you where I'm headed to. Whee! We are almost there. Can anyone guess where we are yet? Oh, have you seen the sign? <laughs> Did you see the sign? Look, there's the ocean in front of us. Oh guys, it's so stunning here. I'm so happy we're gonna be here for the next few days. Okay, so we've just arrived. Look how pretty this place is. We stayed here before. But anyway, I need to go check in real quick. Alright, I'm hanging out here in clothes that look like pajamas because I can't check in just yet. I'm too early. Thought I was late. We got an early check-in, but the room's still not ready. Anyway, I'm just eating so food and I got Diet Coke because I am tired after the trip. I'm going to the room. It's in here on the third floor. <sighs> okay. We have made it, guys. Look how pretty. Oh, nice view. Oh, gorgeous. So happy to be here finally. Ah, oh, two gorgeous rooms with nice mountains outside. And there's another room over there. Can you believe it? We're finally here. And I don't even know if I've said it yet, but we are in 
Laguna Beach. Woo! Okay, so Bella just brought the bags in. I am so happy there are two wardrobes. There's one here and one there. There's a TV here, you can't see it. Um, like over there and then the other cupboard is just there. And I can't even tell you how happy I am that we have two wardrobes. Because I never ever have, we never have enough space if we just share one. I am so beat and I kind of have to unpack now, which is like, but you know, girls gotta do what girls gotta do. I might just like unpack David's stuff because he's really like iffy about like unpacking. He always wants his stuff like perfect. I kind of am the messy one between the two of us and can live like kind of like a homeless person. All my stuff a mess in a bag and just pull stuff out. I, even though I am super organized back home with like my drawers and the, you know the house in Vegas, the kitchen and all the buyers, like everything's neat except my clothes. My clothes for some reason in a bag and I'll just pull stuff out I don't know if it's just because like before I met David I traveled so much like I traveled to over 41 countries I think in total it was 47 so before I met him I was like young and traveling the world on my own and I was living out a suitcase for almost five years so I think that might be one of the reasons why I've adapted this like messy habit <laughs> anyway Let's get unpacking. Oh, actually we can't even do it right now because I requested 40 coat hangers. Yes, 40. And they haven't brought them yet. So I kind of have to wait. I've got six. So I can unpack six items of clothing. <laughs> anyway. It's gonna be really nice staying here because he's gonna to go to work every day and then come back and I'm gonna be here hanging out. Um, going to the beach, you know, just it's so beautiful here. So instead of being at home, I'm gonna be here for the next three days. And then at night, him and I are gonna go have some fun and go to dinner and yeah, it should be really fun. Okay guys, I have just finished unpacking. I put my three pairs of shoes there, like boot ones in case it's like cold, beautiful open ones. And then these are really cool, they're kind of like closed and they've got a little buckle here which is pretty. So like three different types and then obviously sneaks that I'm wearing in case I need. All my stuff is beautifully in the cupboard. just got out the shower I'm gonna do a face mask and then I quickly have to make a phone call I forgot to bring one of my face masks really annoying I unpacked my toiletry bag and they're always in there and then I forgot to put them back in Ugh. okay I have to make a phone call because I need to activate my new credit card I have an online clothing store and all that money gets paid into my credit card and if you guys want to check it out, it's called Envision Apparel. It is amazing. I am going to do another shoot soon and vlog it. It's so nice doing those shoots. It's just like so much fun. And the girls are always really nice. They're always so beautiful. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I wish I looked like you. Like, how unfair is this life? Some people are just so damn gorgeous. Okay, so I'm applying retinol and the Rachiposky, Rachiposky on like uber uber thick because I kind of just want to do like a really moisturizing mask the weather's different here so it's like kind of dry I don't know what I'm going to use as the moisture lock can you put tissue on it I think that might just absorb it absorb it I'm just going to leave it on really thick and I'm going to do a thick layer of 
the Sonia Dacom Vitamin C Serum 2. Oh, sorry, back to what I was saying. If you get so distracted, oof, I'm like probably like the worst mu multitasker in all of the world. So anyway, these girls are so beautiful that I put photograph like models are just models for a reason you know like you see them and they're just like perfect and you're like how so anyway um i mean guys honestly it doesn't matter it's about what's in here so if you meet someone you love it's all about what's on the inside like some girls can just be so beautiful it's such bitches so you know so it's all about the inside. Like my mom thinks I'm cool and that's what matters. <laughs> that's from John Tucker Must Die. Okay, we're gonna let that sit. See how thick it is. I'm gonna add some water to get some extra moisture. I don't wanna break out, so I am gonna wash it off after a bit and then just apply kind of the same stuff but like a lot thinner i am beat it's so beautiful outside i think i just might take a nap with the stuff on my face honestly like i take my hat to my boyfriend he is an absolute machine i don't know how he drives he drives two hours to work and two hours back every single day and he gets like five hours sleep because he works so hard he's just he's like amazing like you don't get people like him it's just businessmen are just different breeds of humans and i mean yeah he's the love of my life and i'm absolutely obsessed with him like you know you're just like sometimes obsessed with human beings he is just one of those people i'm obsessed with and he's amazing i need a nap now because i just went on a little drive <laughs> well it was two hours but it took it out of me and yeah anyway so i'm gonna nap i'm as snug as a bug in a rug oh. okay bye hi i just woke up we're gonna have some macaroons macaroons mm. it boils the kettle Chamomile? No, we'll have English breakfast. There's also green tea. But I don't usually drink tea, even though I've been drinking it in my past two videos. By the way, this is a trick I do. I just put like half in it and let the bag sit for a bit. Pretty sure everyone knows this actually. Actually, my mom doesn't do it and I've never understood why. And then I take cold water and then I put a bit of cold water in so that I can drink it straight away. I'm not usually one of those cup of tea girls, even though I am from South Africa. Um, that's like a very British thing where a lot of like South African ancestors came from like britain europe all over my heritage is actually german so my grandfather's german david says i look like german kind of just i'm not cold like a german person i'm like really friendly and kind and i don't know i guess germans are just like not like normally really cold i think might just be a stereotype <sighs> you love me some good tea Seriously, let's go get ready now. So guys, I'm gonna get up to much funner things, much more fun things tomorrow. So watch the next video when I like actually start exploring this place. I'm doing like a vlog a day for the next few days. That's why this was literally just my day just getting here and you guys seeing where I came. But yeah, it's gonna be a lot more interesting tomorrow okay this is the final look i got these cute shoes on this has a really sexy slit and it's just basically a blue dress and yeah i'm wearing this because it's like freezing here at night i don't know why it's so cold but anyway
Anyway, it's the final look. Cool guys, don't forget to like and subscribe.